Good morning, everyone. We're going to do some unsoldering. Let's unsolder this transformer right here. I've got blocks of wood to steady it so the board's not wobbling around on me. Here's the pads of the transformer that we're going to unsolder. Let's take a picture of the orientation. There's a label on this side. Take a picture of that so I can get it put back on correctly. Now, some transformers, they have equal pins on each side, and you could put it in backwards. I don't want to do that. You'd have the primaries and the secondaries all in the wrong place in the circuit. So, I always take a picture of the orientation. Next, I want to wet the solder of the solder pads. That allows the old solder and the new solder to flow up into the solder sucker much, much easier than if you didn't do this. It just takes a little bit of solder to get it to flowing. Now, let's take our solder wick and we'll get the excess solder off the board. The solder sucker never gets all of the solder off, so I always go, have to go in behind the solder sucker and remove the excess solder. time. Don't get in no hurry. We got all day. The most important thing you want to be concerned with here is not tearing up the solder pads and not destroying the device you're trying to unsolder. <laughs> Some of them didn't get all of the solder out. Let's reflow that one right there. That looks better. That looks better. A little bit more solder come out with that pass. Let's take a look at the other side. See if there's any solder left over on the top sides. Looks like I got most of it. Now, take your iron 
heat up that pan and push it away from the wall of the via. The via is the hole that the pin passes through on the board. You have to break the pin away from the wall of the via. If you go to remove that device and you don't have it broken free from the wall of the via, you'll pull the core of the via out when you go to remove that device that you're unsoldering. So here, take your time and make sure you've broken all of the pins free before you remove that device. Let's see how it comes out now. There we go, look at that. There's our transformer we've just removed from this board. And that is how you unsolder components from a board. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time.